please open up the document called FLE-4 from your school computer and immediately save this in your removable disk and name it Classic CC. If you click Save, you might get this message. So if you get this message, just click Save and skip through that. And the first thing you need to do is you add a new layer above Heading. And we'll call this layer Mask. Now, once you've made that layer, select your Oval tool. And in the Stroll Color, I'd like you to click this option right here, which means that there will be no stroke. In the fill, I'd like you to choose black. And once you've chosen um, no stroke and black fill, I'd like you to draw a circle um, so that yours looks like figure E-10. Now, use your selection tool, drag a marquee around that circle you drew, and go up to the top and insert, click timeline and click create motion tween and then click frame 40 of the mask layer and insert a keyframe and then drag that circle across so that it looks like figure E-11. Okay. So now um, what we've done is we basically um, made an animated circle that goes across the screen. Now, um, click the mask layer to select it and go up to modify and point to timeline and then click layer properties. And that should open up this box right here. Okay, now make sure that show is selected and also click lock and then also click off mask under the type section okay so show is checked off lock is checked off and mask is selected then click OK now um, please save your work and after you saved it I'd like you to play the movie and see what happens basically you'll see that the circle covers the text as it moves across the stage. Okay. Now um, we have to select the heading layer and again go up to modify, go to timeline and select and click layer properties and layer properties opens up again. Now this time make sure that show is checked off, click the lock option and also, where it says masked, check off this box. Okay, Your layer properties box should look like figure E-12. Okay, And now click OK when everything is done. And now I'd like you to play the movie a second time and see what happens. Okay, I'll play it one more time. And you can see that the circle acts as a window that displays the text only within that circle. Okay? You only get to see the text when that circle is going across the text. At this point, you can save your movie uh, again and proceed to the next exercise.